Alice was rather doubtful whether she ought not to lie down on her face like the three gardeners, but she could not remember ever having heard of such a rule at processions. And besides, what would be the use of a procession, thought she, if people had all to lie down on their faces so that they couldn't see it? So she stood where she was and waited. When the procession came opposite to Alice, they all stopped and looked at her, and the Queen said severely, "'Who is this?' She said it to the knave of hearts, who only bowed and smiled in reply. "'Idiot!' said the Queen, tossing her head impatiently, and turning to Alice. She went on, "'What's your name, child?' "'My name is Alice, so please, Your Majesty,' said Alice very politely. But she added to herself, "'Why, they're only a pack of cards, after all. I needn't be afraid of them.' "'And who are these?' said the Queen, pointing to the three gardeners, who were lying round the rose-tree. For, you see, as they were lying on their faces, and the pattern on their backs was the same as the rest of the pack, she could not tell whether they were her gardeners, or soldiers, or courtiers, or three of her own children. "'How should I know?' said Alice, surprised at her own courage. "'It's no business of mine.' The Queen turned crimson with fury, and after glaring at her for a moment like a wild beast, began screaming, "'Off with her head! Off with—' "'Nonsense!' said Alice, very loudly and decidedly, and the Queen was silent. The King laid his hand upon her arm, and timidly said, "'Consider, my dear, she is only a child.' The Queen turned angrily away from him, and said to the knave, "'Turn them over!' The knave did so very carefully with one foot.